Alright guys, been telling people, gonna do a video of the stand, gonna do a video of the stand. Well, it's 1.30 in the morning and dark outside, snowy, it's cold, it's like 13 degrees. But hey, I'm in the garage anyway, because I had to bring some stuff from the house in here. So I'm gonna do a video of the stand. Uh, the only thing that's really lacking is, obviously, I'm gonna put some trim on the corners here and there's a hundred gallon overflow just sort of sitting in top still dirty but uh this piece of aspen here is going to go on top this opening here is wide enough to put my 30 the dirty 30 in here and then I have to build a probably a bifold door that I'm going to use to cover this in that'll be my canister filter area as you can see that's how I did the corners used half inch maple to wrap back and sides, quarter inch maple on the front, and routed out the holes. So it's got a really nice clean look all the way around. It has to get stained once I get the trim. Okay. I absolutely love the look, look of this wood. The best part is, is maple's one of those woods where you can stain it, anything, it'll look like some other wood. So I'm probably going to go with a uh, light chestnut finish on it. And leave the aspen top, just polyurethane, which still has to be done too. And then if you watch my previous videos, you know I got my fire eel and my uh, now two dragon gobies that I'll be setting this tank back up for once my kitchen remodel is complete. Looks like crap right now because all the sand on the back, but it'll get cleaned up. I have two pieces of very large driftwood coming from uh, Turbo. I'll throw a link in his or his link in my video description uh, to his page and his site where you can get some awesome deals on some Mazia and other types of wood. Uh, I got two pieces coming each between two and three foot long uh, and quite a large round that will just fit in this tank. I have a wide side here, tapered down here, then a wide side over here, tapered towards the middle. Uh, it's going to be a sort of a river biotope for the eels. I haven't quite decided on the rest of the livestock yet. A lot of crypts, swords, that type of things. Sand bottomed. Well, yeah, figured I'd do a shot of the tank. Ideas for that. Finally get a video of my stand up. There's a little work left to do on it. I trim it out, make the door, get everything ready. But that's that.